Hello, horror fans, and welcome once again to the Horror Obese. This is day six of my 31 horrors, and the movie is From Hell. Based on Alan Moore and Eddie Campbell's graphic novel, or well, loosely based on their graphic novel, it's about um, the Whitechapel murders, Jack the Ripper. Now, this one was directed by the Huge Brothers, which um, direct the movies like Dead Presidents and Menace to Society and others. I think one of the reasons they were interested in doing, apart from wanting to do a horror movie or suspense mystery horror movie, uh, was that they compared um, kind of like the urban movies that they were used to doing, like you know, Menace to Society and uh, Dead Presidents, to the time in uh, London, the way it was. Um, so like Jack the Ripper was well is famous because uh, pretty much uh, he killed or he murdered uh, only prostitutes you know so at first people were thinking well it's more of a hate crime or you know he has something towards a prostitute and then as Years went by and people uh, went to more investigations into it. I mean, ev at first everyone knew he had some um, medical exper experience by the way he he dissected the bodies or the way he sliced them. Um, they concluded it had to be with a medical knife or something. So, yes, from hell. Now, from hell... Is a very good movie. I, I really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed all oh, two hours. I think it's like two hours. It's it's cool. It kind of wants to like uh, close the case on who Jack the Ripper was, and it's you know um, I've seen books. I've read books, but not in its entirety on the same case of Jack the Ripper. It's a very interesting case. Uh, no one really knows who he was, you know, and obviously on From Hell, it, he, uh, it tells you how he was part of the Freemasons and how he was trying to cover up uh, something about a member, of, I guess, of the Freemasons who married a prostitute and then had a child and uh, since he was like a prince not like a prince, he was a prince, I believe. Um, they didn't want society to know about it, so they used him, mainly because they thought he was already going a little on the edge. Uh, and you kind of, after coming towards the end of the movie, you kind of feel like, okay, yeah, maybe he is already, you know, getting loony and stuff. Uh, I guess uh, some of the favorite quotes that he said is that, uh, what was it something about the 20th century he gave birth to the 20th century or something he says that towards the end after um, the detective Johnny Depp finds out you know who he really is and um, I think if you want to say the love interest here in this movie would be Heather Graham that plays Mary Kelly and in the end it leaves you with a mystery was did he really kill Mary or did he kill that other French girl? I think he killed the other French girl. So, uh, thinking it was Mary. Because Mary had uh, pro Mary had left, I believe, uh, with the prostitute and the prince's baby to another place. Uh, so that kept Johnny Depp's character at ease. It was happy because of that happened when he found out. You know, it's it's a good movie. Good core scenes. I think the Huge Brothers did a good job at it, uh, and you know, it's probably one of those type of movies that not a lot of people talk about, and it's a very good movie. Uh, I still enjoy it as many times as I've watched it. Um, I sometimes get into the mood of watching, you know, Jack the Ripper movie. Um, there's this one, and then there's that Hammer movie called Hands of the Ripper, which is uh, his daughter, I believe. 
I forget it, but I had, I should have it somewhere around here on VHS. But anyway, this is a topic for another video. Uh, but yes, it's the sixth day, day six of my 31 horrors. Hopefully I said that in the beginning. Uh, and the movie is From Hell. And once again, don't forget, follow me at Horror Mino, which I also have one going on called The Horrors of October, which is also something... Uh, it's something similar, only that there I, I post more than I do here. Um, here I'm just doing the one a day thing, and there I put maybe two movies a day, uh, part of that. So, you know, it, it all works out. You know, I, I make it work out. <laughs> you know, it's twice the job, but still, it's fun. I love doing this. So, uh, once again, as I said, uh, From Hell, if you haven't seen it, check it out. Pretty sure you'll like it. Oh, it's a good movie. And, as always, hope you like what you see. Thanks for watching, and now, on to the next movie.